An update on a story you saw first on News 12. Nassau County Police telling us three teens robbed a gas station in Manhasset early yesterday morning and one is on the run right now. News 12's crime reporter Krista McNally has been following this story and is live with the latest details. Krista. That's right, we're on Plandome Road and Northern Boulevard, where police say three teens robbed this gas station that you could see behind me, and they also attacked an employee early Monday morning. These days, I'm not surprised about you here on the news and things going on, so not surprised. 18-year-old Raquan Brooks from the Bronx was arrested for robbing the BP gas station along with two other teens, according to police. They say the other teen arrested is 16 years old, and a third is still on the loose. We would hope that it will be safe to be here. Police say the trio allegedly first attempted to rob a Shell gas station in New Hyde Park. And when a worker called police, they ran off and went to the BP station in Manhasset. At around 5.30 in the morning, police say the teens approached a 48-year-old worker inside, threatened him with a handgun, hit him, punched him, and ran off with cash. I don't see any reason to punch the guy. The guy probably gave him the money. They're working hard, you know, so they don't come here to get hit. You know, you would hope that they would be safe. Two of the teens were caught when police tracked down their Honda Civic. There is no word on the employee's condition. Meantime, Brooks was arrested just a few days ago and is facing charges of reckless endangerment, possession of stolen property, and fleeing from a police officer. He was released without bail for those alleged crimes committed in Yonkers. They have to change our law because he's on the streets doing it again. They're arrested and they're out next day. Again, one suspect in this robbery is still on the run. The two others were arraigned today. Brooks was remanded, which means he will remain behind bars. For now, that's the latest from Manhasset. Krista McNally, News 12, Long Island.